What's up guys, Nerds and Pizza, back with another video for you guys today, and I know I said no more pack openings for now, but we have a special kind of pack opening for today. As you can see, 11 unopened packs, and what we have is one of the 15k packs, 6 of the 88 plus packs, uh, regular gold pack, silver pack, bronze pack, we're trying all the different packs this episode, a little bit of a variety pack opening. Um... Yeah, this is going to be the biggest pack opening I probably do um, for a long time, maybe till November, I don't know. Uh, but basically, we sold the team and bought the World Cup of Hockey collectibles, which go for around 50k each. And we're going to see, can we make profit? And I know this might be a bit of a dumb idea, I know, I know. But we're just going to see if we can make profit out of these. Maybe pull something else in one of the other packs, you never know, we'll see. Um, but yeah. Without further ado, I think we should get started here. Uh, hoping for the best luck possible. I thought, you know, I haven't recorded a live pack opening, so uh, maybe you guys can see the live packs. Um, but yeah, let's just rip into it. We're we'll open this one, go with all the, get this one out of the way, the silver, bronzes, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, hopefully pull something good, because we haven't really pulled anything amazing this year in HUT. Let's see what we're gonna get in this pack. No rare players yet. Spooner 85, 85, and always 85s. It's okay, we're just gonna keep everything we get from these. Sell the stuff later, see how many coins we can get. See how many coins we get out of these uh, 88 plus sets too. Cause you never know. We got eight of them. Or six of them. Maybe. This is a regular 1,000 bronze pack. You guys probably haven't seen any of these. They quick sell for like 430, and if you sold everything in here, you could easily make 1,000. Like, I don't know. Bronze packs could be profit packs. I mean, not much. Like, you're going to only make like 500 to 1K max. But they're still pretty cool packs to open. Just for the jerseys. Possible chance of the bronze team of the week. I think there's some. 77 overall, not bad. Jake Morrissey, Adam Marsh, not bad. Okay, so here we go. We got the silver packs and the gold packs and the just a regular silver pack, the gold packs, and then six of the 88 plus packs. So maybe we get a silver team of the week. No, we're just going to get a 79. They're just bonus packs, you know, just, just trying out different packs, seeing how they're like. You don't see too many people open silver and bronze because they're kind of pointless. Yeah, we're probably going to get an 85 in this pack too. Oh, an 86. Thousand Kadri. Okay, okay. I've seen some people get good luck on these. So here we go. Eight or six. I mean, six 88 plus pack. I keep saying eight because it's 88. So here we go. This is going to be exciting. Now, I've done, I think I've done like six of these before. So uh, it's going to be interesting to see what we can pull out of these. Here we go. First one, Corey Crawford. Terrible. Terrible start. Probably the second worst thing you can pull behind the Wongo. Here we go. Second pack, something big, please. Jeff Carter. All right, that's not bad. That almost breaks even with one collectible. Goes for around 35k, so that's pretty good. Here we go. Fourth one. We're just whipping into them. And boom, Ryan McDonough. That's pretty good as well. All right, three packs left. Whew, let's go. I want to see a big pull, 90 plus. Sidney Crosby, Pavel Bure, Alexander Ovechkin, and Team Week Malkin. Oh, Braden Holpe, let's go. There we go. That's profit right there. He, I think he goes for around 80k or something. So that's definitely uh, a good pull for sure. 91 overall, Braden Holpe. That's the highest pull I've ever got this year. I know it comes from 88 plus pack, but still, that's awesome. Definitely take that. Next pack, Ryan Johansson. He goes for around 20k. So not bad. And last pack here. We're just going to leave the room. Peace out. And let's see what we get. We're back and it's a Taylor Hall. Nice. There we go. So that is not too bad at all. We, I don't know if we made profit. I'm going to have to check. Uh, I guess to end the video, we'll check really quickly what Hall and... Hope we go for. Um, maybe made me profit there. That was that was pretty good. That was not as bad as I expected for sure. I know Hall goes for a decent amount and Hope B. 
the other ones. Uh, yeah, we're gonna once we're gonna try selling every single item we got in this pack opening. I kept every single thing, and I started with 335k. So we're gonna try and see if I can get over 335k. So he goes for around 80k. Um, 80k, yeah, close to 80k. And then Holpi, I believe he goes for 80k, maybe 70, 70 least. Cause I know goalies don't go for a lot. Only price goes for like 100. Uh, Holpi, 70k, I think, right? Yeah, 70k. All right, so that's 80k, 70k. That's 150k right there from those two polls. I definitely appreciate that, EA. That was, I mean, I, I was scared, honestly. I thought we were getting really bad pulls with this. I would have liked a special card, but. Um, so we got Holpi, 70k. Hall, 80k, 150k, 170k. I think McDonough is 30k, so that's like 200. And Carter, who's about 230. And so, yeah, out of, out of the. Um, I think I bought six of them for 50k each. That's about 300k. And with these five pulls, I think we got around 250k, so not too bad. We didn't lose as much as I really thought we would. We also have all these other guys that we can sell. And I'm going to get pretty close to what I had before. I probably won't be able to buy all the players that I sold. Uh, if you guys want to see what I sold. Uh, the team I was rocking for maybe five games. I'm probably going to buy most of these players back, because I'll probably be able to buy most of them probably buy a couple different players that I didn't like um, but yeah thank you guys for watching this video definitely enjoyed a couple good pulls didn't get wrecked and uh, yeah so I really hope you guys enjoyed that because uh, that was a scary thing to do but I think it'll be worth it once we sell everything and yeah so if you guys are new to the channel hit the subscribe button and as always leave a like if you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in another video I'm out peace